Attacking from the middle of the floor. And USD right now, the more confident of the two teams, the more sure of themselves on the offensive end. Well, this game is just full of interesting matchups. Buda here with the steal and the highlight reel. Chance to tie or take the lead on this possession. They've been trailing most of the well, wins it on Amuda here. That's the matchup right here. You got to watch. This is advantage Amuda, no question. Big time last night on the boards. AJ puts away, getting a long rest here as Amuda just taking hold. Archambeau. No good. Rebound pulled in, and here is Showtime coming. Stanley Amude with the win. That gets magnified in the game right now where you're struggling to get stops. Oh. Picks up another foul. That's four on North Dakota State. U.S. Amude. Tough. Working on Cruz Piro Hunt. And that's a great shot there from Griesel because Pierre Cruiser. Yeah, that's an important basket for NDSU. They need a little bit of a spark. Cruiser provided it again. Man, them to sustain this is going to be tough, t tough for Umude to sustain the level that he. That is a very difficult yeah. shot by Umude. It hasn't been enough of that tonight. Umude now with Shireman on him. Rise it up over him. Yep. We hope everybody's yeah. back in here sooner rather than later. Amude going to work. Got McGowan's in the air. Got the bucket of the so far. Many teams have battled a lot of COVID issues and contact tracing that kept their. Buys a little out of sorts offensively right now. Amude trying to attack. He does. Age of shooting the three as Harden Hayes does and misses. Amude just. Well, here's Amude. Up over the top of Cruiser. Amude spots up for three in a row. Figures. Four points, though. Three rebounds, three steals, two blocks. And they spread the floor a little bit. Make some of the North Dakota State bigs have to come out and guard like that right there. And all those guys on the floor, it's their first Summit League Conference tournament game. Amude certainly go out here running the point with Piero Hunt on the bench. And Boogie Anderson unavailable. And back to work goes Amude. Oh, that's a I don't think the tempo offensively of Mude. Again, after Western worked so hard. Mude with care. Mude spots up deep threes. Amateros into the post. Fall away for Stanley. Game South Dakota leading by 16. That's their one off their largest lead of the night. And Mude. If this game would be pretty interesting. It's been even. 41-38. Kyle's in front. Stanley Amude. Credit to the opportunities. Tough runner by Cruiser. Misses everything. Defended well. From the perimeter. Here's Cruiser. Driving around Kamateros. But again. Four. Riesel. Mid-range. One guy in some decent trouble at this offensive rebound from Odell Wilson. Straight coming in, missed his first today, and that hasn't missed since. And another. Every college freshman should have to study the career of Ben Tupanoam. He's a guy that is going to step up here. Fuller 
Amude inside. The senior from San Antonio gets the. Amude trying to go. That cut well defended by UND. Amude on the dribble. Off the glass and in. Fuller coming up with the big time swat. Amude in transition. Sucre. Nero with 13 off the bench. Amude, a quiet save for him. Hits. Going, that's okay. But if they only have one or two players in double figures, I think UND likes their chances. Here is Amude. 9 4 our score early. Amude, tough take. It's UND hits about seven threes a game, fifth in the conference. They've got four already. And the conference's best player at this point is a great way to jumpstart your offense. If you've struggled, I feel like Phil Pabracha has drawn that assignment now. But outside of that, it's going to be him. Chance for the Coyotes to get a little closer. Amude right at Rabracha. Tough. To Amude in that matchup with Wilson. Oh, nice slip right away. Tough shot to get it started. 15 rebounds last night for the Coyotes. Yeah, huge, especially on the defensive end. Really controlled it. Parrot Hunt with the rebound. Amude screaming. Eaton. Nothing here tonight for him. Yeah, did not score last night, has not scored tonight. Amude. Fuller leaves it off. There's nothing wrong with a foul like that. I mean, Fredell's trying to make great things happen with some hustle. That's the motor he needs to play with. Zizic with another rebound. He's got seven now. Amude around Winget. And it's been this into the floor. Eustis had an answer throughout this game offensively. Amude around Winget. Defensive stops and a lot of them here of late on this end. A double machine all season long and almost the triple double with those numbers. I believe calling for Kamateros to get back to the table. Amude. Look. 37 points a half. But neither team's been able to get it cooking at all offensively. There, nice pass in the Flitza White now. Maybe that'll kind of help preserve him's fouls. Amude took a 56% from the field on Friday night. Stanley Muda, 8 of 12. The pile. Zizic kept it alive. Now Plitza White dumps it off. Throws it down. Wide open look for a move for Omaha. Tried the back door. Amude's jumper. Here's Zizic. Nice dump. Amude for the. And here's Plitza White. Stand deep three. Got it. Amude up and over the top. Here's Fuller, who's hit some big triples here in this second half. Baseline jumper, plus. Omaha doesn't need a ton of time with the way they like to play in transition. Amude struck. To bend the season, you got to hit those open looks. And those were their experienced guys that answered to White. Deep three, Amude. Carroll Hunt wanted to post up for Kamateros. Instead, they'll feed the hot hand. Amude spins into the paint. The other one, Gonzaga. They're Not pretty good, bad I think. company to be in in any capacity. Oh, that's something they haven't had in years past quite to this degree. And when you're limiting second chance opportunities, and when you also... Keeps that one alive. Kyle's working around the perimeter. Back into the hands of Amude for...
Carroll on shooting to improve, but defensively, that's why he starts with this group. A mood all the can't wait to see Townsend and see if he's gonna get more involved shooting the, foot, the football, the basketball. Mude driving another tough. Amude found himself open and took it. Blitz away. Back to Amude. Fakes the defender. Open for three and nail. Amude working inside against Green. Hey. Gets it ahead to Amude. Amude tries to weave between <laughs> three starters. Could be an issue. Yeah. Deep three from Stanley. Amude. Amude for three. Yes, sir. And now Amude gets the steal. In transition, Euro stepping in. to shoot for USD. Coyotes with the opening possession of the basketball game. Farrell Hunt down to the right block, white between the rings, sends it left side onto the perimeter to Archibald, who bounces a pass down to the baseline of Uday. Double team front end of one and ones. So a potential chance for four points. Layup too strong. Rebound tapped out to Farrell Hunt. Long pass ahead. Here's a move. Blitz White swings a one-handed pass to Xavier Fuller. Coyotes just have not been able to find a lot of open. Yeah, no doubt about it. I mean, USD was really struggling. They came in shooting 20% from three before on both ends. Right back to the man. To Cruz Parrot Hunt. Amude has already got a dozen and he drops. And a half. They have cut 10 points off the lead. Amude has not. Winget fortunate there, gambled, and Amude can make those kind of plays too on the D end. I mean, one certainly feeds the other, and he's just feeling oh. it, the Coyotes here. And I tell you, they've had the look in their eye. That guy's had the look in his eye the whole night. Oh, oh my God. And it Two most explosive, definitely offensive players. Amude again. Offense. Amude is going to step into a three, and Skunberg, the freshman, chasing around. Splits away. Mamude stops and pops again. Griezel finding an opening. Another steal and another turnover. Mamude out in front of everybody. He'll cruise in for the jam. Right now on this possession. Mamude got the step, drives in pretty. Mamude straight on three. Mamude on the back door, cut with the. Another three for Mamude. Why not? Mude for three. Mude off glass. Each looking for their first victory of the season. And here's the two star players for each squad going at each other. A Mude. Three nothing start for the Huskers. Jump down low and looking for a Mude out there right now with two fouls. Two for the Huskers and a Mude for the Coyotes. Eight point lead for the Huskers. A Mude. And Archambault. Mude. 12 on the shot clock. And Mude on the run. That floats. Get all the way to the rim. Stanley Amude. Uh, matched up against West Virginia out of the Big 12. Bob Huggins expects to have a really good team this year. They drop. Eddie, a full-time starter last year, part-time starter the year before. College basketball, he wins those battles like an offensive lineman, and the other guy's bouncing. He gets foul calls against him. <laughs> the other guys are dropping to the to scoot back and shooting another three. That was you know, way too close yeah. for him. Basketball's got a big body. 